Hi guys, it's me, Voice Over Destiny again. So, if you guys haven't checked out my most recent video, which was the new Japanese hair care products, I suggest you check that out before watching this video. I basically went to the short store and showed you guys all the new products that I got, so I'm going to be featuring one of those brands in this video. I'm sure you know by the thumbnail already, but... This is my hair, a matted mess. It's an old braid out. My braid out was trash and I'm over wearing my hair in a ponytail. So the products that I'm using today are Ma and Me Latte. This is the shampoo. It was super, super creamy. I tried to show you, but that was a fail. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in a previous video. I do not always section my hair and then shampoo. Sometimes it's just too much for me and I don't feel like being bothered with all the sections. So today I'm shampooing my hair just as a whole. I'm, I am going to shampoo my hair two times because I want to make sure I get all of the product out of my hair from the previous braid out that I had. Just to make sure I'm working on a clean slate. I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely love shampooing my hair. Like having all the suds and I don't know, it just really excites me. And then... I don't know, that clean feeling is just amazing. So this shampoo in particular really cleansed my hair but also left my hair super moisturized. My hair did not feel dry and this is just the first shampoo. This is the second shampoo and it's a lot more lather um, because my hair is pretty much clean from the first one. But I just want to make sure I got everything really, really good. The ends, the roots, everything. And I am thoroughly enjoying this process. So. The conditioner, it was super thick. I had to take the top off, sis. Like, I had to squeeze. Look at how thick that is. It's so thick, and I really, really love that. Like I said before, I've never used these products, so when I opened the bottle, I was like, okay, this is new. I like this. I like this. So, it smelled really, really, really good. I really did enjoy the smell of the conditioner, consider considering that it was super thick. I did get a lot of moisture from this conditioner. I was able to detangle. I definitely detangled with a comb this time because I was not about to finger detangle. I was just being super, super lazy. So, um, yeah, I detangled with a comb, a wide tooth comb, and I was able to get through my hair pretty quickly. I really did enjoy this conditioner a lot. So I did rinse out the conditioner um, from my hair. This is what my hair looks like with no product on it. It was super moisturized, super detangled. I would highly recommend the shampoo for real. And it's hard for me to recommend shampoo sometimes because most of the times they are stripping. But this one in particular was really, really moisturizing. And the conditioner was so thick. It really did penetrate my hair really, really well. No product and I still have a lot of definition. My curls are popping and no product at all. Anyway, let's fast forward to the rest of this video. So I finished shampooing my hair. I finished conditioning it. And so far, so good. I don't know if it's too early to speak, but so far, so good. I'm going to do like a winter wash and go because it's getting cold here in J-Pizzle and I am not going outside with my hair wet. So I did section my hair off into four sections, applied a little bit of the conditioner, and then I twisted it up so it's still pretty damp. I'm going to add some strong styling gel, ultra super hold, strong keep. This is what it looks like. Um, I've used it before. I hated the results, <laughs> so I never like posted what it looked like. But I want to try it again just because I want to do a wash and go. I'm kind of tired of braid outs and twist outs, so I'm gonna start in the back with this section. I'm pretty sure it's like still soaking wet. So it's 
So basically, I'm just going to go through each section and apply gel. But this is what my hair looks like with just the conditioner in it. It feels really good. It smells really good. So that's exciting. My hair is not thick. So I don't have to use like really big sections. So we're only going to use a little bit of gel. Not that much. Maybe like that much. Can you see that? Hopefully. Maybe like a dime size amount. And then we're just going to put it on each section. I... Uh, if I'm being honest, I never use gel for my wash and goes because I just don't like gel like that. I like it for slick back ponytails and stuff like that, but for wash and goes and this gel in particular, it smells like um, nail polish remover, and it's just, I don't know. I don't know. But we're just going to put it on each section. I don't know, y'all. <sighs> Where I never take my own advice. Um, it looks okay so far, so good. I don't know. I'm gonna finish the rest of my hair and then I'll come back before I sit under the dryer. I've applied all of the gel to my hair. And I don't know. My curls seem to be clumped together a lot, which I like. <sighs> I'm gonna sit under the dryer and then I'll be back after it's dry to tell you what I really think. But right now, it's all right. I'm just, it's just, it's just all right, okay? It's just all right. So I'm fresh from under the dryer. My hair is like 95% um dry it's super crunchy the only part that's wet is where i had those silver clips right up here um everything else seems to be pretty dry my roots seem to be pretty dry but right here it seems to be a little wet um which is fine because i'm gonna add some japanese oil to my hair and then i'm gonna stretch it and then we're gonna come back to see what the final result is but so far so far it's good <laughs> so far it's good and i'm surprised Ooh, girl, ooh, girl. <laughs> Hello, curls. Hello, curls. Y'all, do you, do, do you, do you, do you see that? <laughs> no more crunch, sis. No more crunch, okay? This is curls for the girls, alrighty? <laughs> Before we jump right into these products, I want to tell you what I used on my hair. I used some Japanese oil and I sectioned my hair and I blow dried it and then I banded it. And I left it in for about 10 to 15 minutes and then I took them out and these are the results. I absolutely love my hair. As soon as I put the oil on my hair, the crunch was gone, like completely gone. So let's get into these products because I don't want this video to be long. So the shampoo, oh my God. The shampoo is super creamy. It's supposed to be moisturizing. I'm going to assume because it's like white and I don't know it was really moisturizing for me I really did like it considering my hair was pretty tangled and matted from an old braid out the next product is this conditioner as you guys saw this conditioner is so thick like it's so thick it did allow me to detangle my hair so I really like this product and um I did have this product on my hair before I applied the gel and it was still so moisturizing like my hair was super moisturized with just this conditioner alone as far as this gel is concerned <laughs> I still think it smells like a nail polish remover will I use it again yeah because I still have some more left especially these two products together to get this wash and go baby baby like why not why not boom this is like a dynamic duo i swear 
If you guys do combine products, I'm sure you're aware that most companies don't want you to combine it with another product that isn't from their brand or whatever because they usually don't mesh well. But these two, these two together are getting me these bomb results. This like, girl, 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 are, are you here? Are we, are we here? Are we here? Are we friends now? Good. Because I'm trying to put you up on game, all right? So, if you guys like these kind of videos, you already know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe, share where you share videos. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye!